Oh, too soon. Yep. <laughs> British Pals, how you doing? Welcome back to another video. It's turning into a beautiful morning. Uh, a bit misty, a bit cold this morning, zero wind, but it's gonna be a beautiful day. Slept pretty good last night. Ate some steak, drank a little bit of whiskey. We got up fairly early, messed around, had some breakfast, cut some firewood. All the prep stuff for the day. We are pretty much ready to go. So what we'll do is we'll just kind of pick our way up Real slowly, real casually. Let's see if we can find a couple of early morning fish. That's about it. Look to it. Come on. Just eat something. Just drop back in front of me. Don't move. You might have seen me. Pretty tough to get to this guy. So I've gone dry dropper, and then a 5X size 16 fly. Slightly weighted. See if I can get near this guy. Tricky. Tricky drift. Right about there. You should have seen that. Right there. Not even moving. Something's changed. The water's got very, very skinny and we've stopped seeing fish so i've seen two and they've been mega spooky and then we've walked probably almost a k now not seen anything little bits of holding water not oh that might be a fish yeah i found a fish i'll take that back nothing not even looking Coming over. Oh, come on. Come in. Elevating. Oh, come. It's not quite sure what it is he wants to eat. Oh, it turned out, he wanted it. Oh yeah, he's looking at that so hard, eh? Coming over again. Oh, just eat it, dude. Yeah, that guy we were just talking about, he's a brown and he I've seen him eat off the top. Gone. <laughs> what time is it? Uh, 20 past 10. 
three hours? Three hours for that three, dry fly three, and yeah. I've pulled it out of his mouth? Yeah. Oh, idiot. There's another one there. Where? Just in front of where that one took yours. It just stayed off the top again. Did he? Yeah. Alright. See if I can mess this up as well. Well, we looked at that. Yeah. Oh. oh, oh, small, but I will take you, you beautiful, beautiful brown trout. Oh man, she is pretty. Yeah, yeah, nice. oh, mind that rock, mind that rock, mind that rock. Stop it, stop it around the rock. Okay, I'll try and bring her. Oh, I'll bring her to you. You good? You good? You good? Oh. <sighs> <sighs> Go in behind and I'll just that's it. Oh man! Good stuff. Dude! Oh that's that's gonna be one of the prettiest browns I've seen for ages. That metallic or gill plate as well. That's so pretty. So after I pulled the fly out of the previous fish's mouth, um, Jared spotted that fish well, a little bit a few minutes earlier, right? He dropped down. Saw it earlier, yeah. yeah. And we found her again and just uh, yeah, a couple of a couple of drifts and she just came up, ate that dry fly and so pretty. Oh yeah, beautiful. That's gonna be the prettiest brown I think maybe I've caught this season. Just stunning. Stunning. Alright, that took me almost four hours to catch that fish. That was ridiculous. Over to Jared. I'm almost quite relieved that the pressure's on you now. <laughs> uh, and that took a size 14 dead cert from Cat 3. It's a great little fly. Brilliant. Uh, okay, let's go. I was kind of, I kind of thought, I don't know, I just kind of, we've just been seeing browns for a while. The few fish we have seen have been browns. I kind of thought maybe we'd seen the last of the rainbows, but that was a great fish. All over the place, got the right drift, ate the dry fly. That's size 14 I gave you, eh? Yeah. Size 14, dead sir, again. Such a good fly. Category three flies. Go and get yourself some 14s. Go and get yourself some 16s and some tricky situations. And you're pretty much covered for most things that eat off the top, to be honest, here anyway. And another thing, yes, that is my sock. I lost my lens cap yesterday, so I've had to revert to uh, sock cap, cap sock. So yeah, I have got a sock as a lens cap now. That's how, that's how I roll. We can get one more fish each. That'll be solid.
Okay, found a fish moving around heaps as a rainbow. If I can get a good drift to him, then with a chance here. Yeah. Nice to get a, a rainbow to even out the pair. Just having trouble locating him right now. Oh, is that him up the front? Oh, I can see him. I got him. Right about there. That's where he was. Oh, he is. Yeah, don't know if my fly is getting down though. It's kind of down deep in the fast stuff, so I'm just going to go size 12 stone fly, see if we can get his attention. Got him! Nice! Just saw his mouth go. Yeah, nice fish. Dude, so strong. It really wants up. I hadn't eaten from him with a dry dropper, but now judging on where he was, I'm not sure that I did. But basically, worked him with a dry dropper for a little bit, got nowhere, thought I'd spooked him, found him sitting deeper in the fast stuff again. So I just changed to a size 12, size 12 stonefly, uh, 101 Cat 3, and then just pumped it out into the fast stuff, and then just, just saw a mouth flash in the fast current and then lifted on that and that was it that was enough really good fish you said four and a half four and a half that's my fish of the trip size wise anyway pretty little brown good rainbow yeah <clears throat> It's a beautiful ground.
lucky man. The afternoon has turned into a something pretty similar to yesterday really. You know, just trying to get Jared his second fish. Lots of shots. Very spooky fish. Okay, found a fish. Fly changing. What the hell is it? perfect? Got it. Nice. Wow, that was frustrating. I could not get this fish to eat anything. Anything. I was trying everything and watching him eat everything else in front of me. Let's inside out. Nice. Oh. Cheers. Yeah, it looks like he's had a run in with an eel not too long ago, really, eh? Yeah, looks like an eel bite to me. That's us, we're done. That was another tough day. What are we in, with three or four fish between us? We're really cool to see some new water. And um, yeah, plenty of fish. Saw lots, had, had some opportunities, but man, if everything wasn't just like perfect in every way, that was it, game over. So we're going to break everything down. There's a track we can find, and then we can pretty much walk that straight back to camp pretty tired so I actually can't really think what to say to finish oh. this video so <laughs> we're gonna leave it at that we're gonna walk back to camp eat some food have an early night and then we're gonna walk out of here tomorrow so anyway I hope you enjoyed this one guys give me a thumbs up drop me a comment in the comment section below and all that good stuff so see you later to Jared we've got to come this way I don't know see you. Sure. <laughs> have a great weekend everyone we'll see you on the next one peace